I'm my name is Bruce Alaric, and today we're going to show you how to actually make a beautiful container like this and we're going to start with finding your container and how to put the soil in properly so that you're ready to, to actually plant. And in this particular case, uh, we've selected a couple plastic pots. The container could be out of any kind of material that you, that you want to use. The biggest thing is to make sure that there's a hole in the bottom of the container. So in this particular case, there's only one hole. Uh, in this larger pot, there are multiple holes. And what we want to do is to cover up that hole some way so that the soil doesn't wash out. So it can be really simple, just using a rock with a single hole, just place it right on top of the hole. On the larger pot, it could just be some uh, paper, paper towel, or even a few sheets of newspaper. So the big thing to do is to find your soil. And you don't want to just go outside and dig up some soil in your yard because the soil is going to be too heavy then the water's not going to drain through the pot and your plant's probably not going to do well, probably going to die. So uh, ideally what you do is you can either make yourself a good mix or the easiest thing to do is go to the local garden center and get a, a very light peat-like material. I want to fill it to about an inch below the surface or an inch below the lip of the pot and a lot of people like push it straight down and it's one of the things that you don't want to do is you don't want to push it straight down you actually want to have it mounded slightly in the center that way when you put a plant in the center you're going to have more of a mounded type of plant and a, more, more, a nicer looking uh, bowl. So our next step is we already have the soil in the pot and we're ready to start planting. And uh, today we're gonna put some pansies in. We've got these. So these are really beautiful pansies, um, all different colors in here. So we're gonna have a nice, nice mix. They're gonna come in a tray similar to this. And uh, all we're gonna do is just pop this, just give it a little squeeze on the bottom. And it's gonna come right out. And you know, it looks great. That's what you're looking for, beautiful white roots like this. A lot of people want to tear these apart. Don't do that. It's make your life easier. And actually, when you're tearing the roots apart, you're hurting the plants. So what we're going to do is we're just going to, I like to start in the middle here. We're going to get it right in the center. And it just has to be basically at the same soil, soil height. And you'll notice that it's a little higher in the center. And we'll just continue doing this with the other trays. Sometimes you can pop them right out. And all we have to do is get some soil contact in here. And we're just going to keep coming around the side here. Sometimes if you have a little too much soil in, you just take some of that soil and put it in another pot for the time being. Because we're going to be bringing some of that back to fill in some of the small areas that we missed. So we want to fill in all the air spaces. So we pretty much have what we're looking for. It could be actually be a little tighter. I got a couple more trays, a couple more uh, plants in here, but I think this will fill out real nicely. And then what I'm going to do is just come back in here, fill in some of those open spaces, push the soil down a little bit. I like to give it a, one more little tap here. It kind of brings all the soil and puts it right in between everything. Gets everything down in here nice and tight. And at this point, it's pretty much complete. Very simple to do. Uh, a couple times I like to just do one more little thing that you can, you can do. You can add some additional color depending upon the season. So in this particular case, you know, you could actually add some, these are called red, red stem dogwoods. Could put a few of those in here for additional interest. Now we have our container already potted. It's really beautiful. Just make sure this gets watered and set it out and you're ready for the season.